Well, I mean, did you see uh, if you were able to read on any of this the the, the um, you know the conviction or the charges originally go back more than 25 years ago, back in 1981, and so for some reason, which may or may not be known, and it's probably not known at this time, they the the trumped up reason. Um, nature and cause of their raids, so to speak, was for drugs, which they've been doing different places, all you know, all over the country. So, um, you know, and folks feel like, well, you know, that what reason did they have? What did we do? What did we? What could we possibly have done? You know, to provoke it. We're just hunters and like to provide for our family, or you know, enjoy hunting and and the. It's just a normal, it's a normal family, and then they get, you know, uh, unreasonably searched and uh, their property seized. It seems like it's a violation, you know, at that point. So then the the question is, what do we do? Because uh, obviously, with when eight or ten officers come and raid, uh, you you're just wondering, what is it that you can, what what is it that you have uh, against something like that? Well, if we remain isolated, I mean, I, it's um, it is one of my favourite films, uh, even though it's terribly violent and and it, it doesn't necessarily represent history correctly. But remember the scene in Gladiator. I mean, and I'll have to qualify. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think you the Gladiator. Scene. Yeah, very good. Film. Yeah, the, the scene was he said, "If we stick together, we have a better chance of survival." Yeah. Then we're on our own. And 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 some. Most listened, some didn't, and you know what happened to the ones that didn't. And the point is that the system is a system perfecting bully, perfecting cruelty, where it picks us off one by one. And the, 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 the issue is, do I spend my efforts, because it takes a huge amount of time, huge amount of energy, do I spend my efforts whittling them down on a matter of principle as they lay more and more charges against me or do I use this as a wake-up call to say I'm going to talk to my neighbours I'm going to talk to my friends and look we've never thought of really being active as a community but this has really gone far enough we are going to step up and become a community what's a community we meet what do we do we talk we share we educate it's not all based purely on Eucadia it's about we are actually going to look after one another. Now, if that is what comes out of this, then they have made, they being those that un, unfairly invaded your home, have done a terrible mistake because what they've done is that they've motivated you to no longer live your life as, a, as an individual but to come together as a community. Now, that is what's going to change. So long as people put themselves out there and allow this imaging training to go on so they can pick people off one after the other, whether it be DOT plates or what, uh, uh, you know, different, different things that people are doing to express their rights, then nothing's going to change. But if we focus on community and sharing and looking after one another, boy, that is what's going to change. Because then when you do go down to court, you won't be on your own anymore. There'll be a community. And with that community, we can build a grand jury. We can build a court. We can build a judge and roles and witnesses and affidavits and a register. And that's what we build. That's what we're trying to say. But before, paperwork can't change that. Learning and motivation and wanting and being are the things we need. And that's what's happening. People are becoming communities. They're working together. Now, now they're ready for how do you function as a grand jury? How do you deal with, with forms of law in your own court? How do you deal with your own register? How do you build then a self-sustaining community with money? All of those can come after people are willing to stop being islands. So that's what I hope the, the, the anger or direction or frustration of what happened here will be directed towards that. Yes. Yeah. People are seeing the differences all around by assembling and uh, really that's probably what is feared the most because when people come together, 
they really aren't going to mess with those mess with those assemblies and communities that come together. Um, okay. Well, Frank, we have gone way past our time here. I don't know what your schedule yes. is like. Um, I'm no, going to have to. I'm going to have to go. And look, I'm I'm sorry that we had the technical interruptions, and I probably missed quite a few of the the questions that people want to ask. Um, look, I, I please uh, collect them up, and and I'll try and get through them all um, ahead of the next call. I really appreciate uh, Terry, and I appreciate the calls that came through, uh, and I hope that the knowledge we're doing is is helping, and really. I, as I've said this before, you are the ones that make the difference, not me. I, I'm doing my bit, but ultimately you are the ones that will make this work. You're the ones that will carry this through. And I really am encouraged by hearing from so many that you are finding a difference by working in a community and coming together, because that's what it's all about. Yes, well, thank you with that. Thank you for everything, Frank, and thank you for spending the extra time tonight with everyone. And we tried to get through most of the questions. It looks like we possibly missed three or four, and we really apologize for that. And I hope, hope you all enjoyed the call and got as much out of it uh, as you possibly could. And another place to post the questions, Frank, would also be over there on the university.ukbio.info website. Yeah, now I, I've been remiss and because of the work I'm doing, doing, I haven't been answering all the questions that have been posted, but I will say to those that are on the call, if I haven't answered it, you have a right to post your question and I will make a point of getting over to the U of U and answering questions because, yeah, you have every right to ask and you need to get answers no matter what the question is. So if you do that, yes, I will make a point of getting across and, and trying to get through them all. Okay. And, and also, if we haven't um, been able to get to all of your questions, if you uh, join us next week, we'd love to get to those questions next week as well. Um, so feel free to do that. Um, yes. Everything still on schedule then for next week, Frank, or are you needing to uh, be moved? So next again? week's fine. Um, and hopefully, the way the move will work is I, I won't uh, I won't be off the air, but. Yes, yeah, so next week is great, same time, same place. Okay, well, thanks, everyone, for joining us tonight. And with that, that's a wrap. And thank you very much, Frank. Have a good day. And uh, we'll see everyone next week. Thank you, Terry. Thanks, everyone. Good night. Okay.